Hello everybody, Shadow here, and welcome back to Outer Wilds. We are on the lookout for three codes. And we are getting close. So we know the locations of them. But we have to get there first. Okay. So this one, let's see. Where was this one again? So this one you had to like follow some lights, right? Where do I find those lights to follow? Um. There were basically like fairies or, you know, fireflies or something, you know? That led us through. I, I should have paid more attention to where exactly that started. Maybe it was over there? I hope so. Oh, yes, okay. I don't remember it screeching like that. I feel like we should come back here and wait, because I'm pretty sure this is where they started, right? Oh! You know, I didn't expect to see anyone here. Um. Great. Oh my. Hi. Oh. You know, that's fair. <laughs> that was really not what I was expecting to happen. I was I was not expecting to have to contend with other people trying to get here. Now I kind of wish that I did, in fact, um, as I was getting here, I had a thought of maybe I should go to the, the high place, um, the, the third entrance, and then from there, 
I can get... I can go here. I don't know how close I need to be trailing this person. I hear a lot of steps. This is probably not a great viewing experience. <laughs> supposed to do <laughs> but but what but uh, okay was I supposed to just run through the fireplace just be like, hey, I'm here now. Bye. <laughs> or was I... <sighs> what did I... <sighs> what was I supposed to do? That's the question. Cause like obviously I'm I'm running up into the dam breaking. Oh, maybe I have to Ooh. Maybe I have to let the dam break. I wonder if that's it. Because after the dam breaks, all of their lights go out. So if I'm in a different spot, they will all disappear, but I won't. I bet that's it. Okay, I'm going to try that. Okay. I bet that's it. Also, the dam's about to break right now. <laughs> yeah, it's it's close. It's very close. We should probably get a move on, shouldn't we? I don't wait. Hold on. No, I need that. <laughs> wait. No, hold on. I need that. Wait. Thank you. Okay. I really hope this is the solution and I'm not just overcomplicating things. Because, you know, I tend to do that a lot. <laughs> but it does it it does make sense as a solution. 
because you get knocked out in when you're in that location. So they would too. And of course, their corpses are all, you know, they really let themselves go. Just like the dam. <laughs> okay. Well. Um. Yeah. I could theoretically get try to get this one too. I'm not going to. I'm going to focus on getting the first one because we have the theory that we need to have them be gone. So I think it is smarter to do that first, and then if we have time, we can try to get more. Would you come faster? Thank you. All right. Away! <laughs> I lied. <laughs> I very much lied. Um, so I think my plan does work, but I forgot that there is a door that you can't go through unless you make sure you open it, um, from the correct side. So... Um, instead, we're going to try to get this one. Oh, wait, don't move. Okay, so where was... Aha! Clever. All right. Excuse me? Oh, no. They're mad. Oh no. Um, okay, well, um, Oh, oh no, that's, that's one of them coming down. I'm not here. Oh no. Oh, 
Dang it. <sighs> we were so close to. We were so close. Ah. Uh... And I think at, at that point, the, the cycle's too, too close to being done. I, I don't think we have time. Ah. I hate this. I hate it so much. And by hate it, I mean I, I really love it. I really, really do. Um, I'm just stressed at uh, time-based stuff. Oh, I can't believe it. Okay, here we go. This is terrible. I, I hate this really, really badly. Okay, we are at the like very start of the loop though. Oh, uh, this is very sketchy. Oh, this is this is terrifying. I feel like they're going to be around any corner. Is one following me? Oh, good gravy, I hate this. Dang it. Okay, so not there. That's good to know. Oh, this is tricky. This is so tricky. Okay, so 
Oh my gosh. Oh, thank goodness. The game is merciful. They don't make you have to go all the way back and re-extinguish the stuff again. So that at least makes things easier. What doesn't make things easier is when it's like this, um, you probably can't see anything. And I, I genuinely, I also cannot. Like it is, it is pitch black. I have no idea what I'm walking to. So, yeah, it's very stressful. Oh my gosh. Wait, who? Where? Oh, gosh! Where did you come from? <laughs> uh, I don't know where I'm going. I like stress, I, I like stealth, but I like stealth where I can see what I'm doing. This is not that. And there's the dam, which means I am running out of time. Why can't you people be nice? Okay, so it's it's fairly easy to get down here at least. I don't know what's happening. Oh, nope. Never mind. Don't worry about it.
Yeah, I, f I had a feeling you were going to find me. <sighs> How do I get there? Like, obviously, I have to get onto that stage. But it seems like if I try to lure them, um, I just end up cornering myself. Maybe I need to be... I'm wondering if I need to be more aggressive. Because, like, right now, I am being very careful. Let me test with this guy. Yeah, he approaches very, very slowly. If all the others are like him, we could draw them out and loop them around. That might be what we want to do. I think I may, maybe I'm over, maybe I've been over complicating things. Oh, hi. Don't mind me. Just a, just a frog, you know. I really was overcomplicating things. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so easy. <laughs> <laughs> Incredible. Oh. So all of their records are still here. They're just they're just here here. What is what? Hold on. Okay. Oh, I so I I see. Okay. I understand. So they scan it, yep. They see what happens. And then they begin constructing that to block the signal. Okay. So these are these must be the the different slides that were like burned and stuff. Oh, duh. D. So yeah, you have to have the lantern to go through. Yep, that makes sense. Oh, 
again. I did it again. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Oh, no. Right. So... What else am I supposed to do here? So that door closes. Is there anything f further along? I'm pretty sure this door is... Did I get what I needed from here? Like, I got information, but I didn't get my code. Ow. Like, what, what is... That's supposed to have the code behind it. Did I do something wrong? Or am I... Is there another step I need to do? Um, I think I might pause and double check just to make sure. Because I don't want to miss... I don't want to have to come and redo this again. Uh, even though I figured out it was pretty easy. Okay, I think we're good. I think we figured it out. I think that was it. I, I guess it was just those three things. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Hello. I don't really care. <laughs> I don't need to be here. Okay. Uh, we're gonna doze off again. But now we're gonna try to get to the first one. I don't know if we have enough time, but we're gonna try it. I'm actually not sure if this is correct anymore um, because of that slide that we saw. Um, we might not be able to... The, those guys, the ones that are patrolling in the first area might actually still be alive even after their body's flames are uh, put out. We'll see, I guess. I actually opened the door this time, so we should be able to get through. <laughs> oh, we've ran out of time. Great. <laughs> All right. I guess let's meditate till the next loop then. Great. <laughs> maybe we can actually try it the legit way again. And maybe we'll get lucky. Or maybe there's, you know, maybe there's some trick to it.
Oh, also, we should probably end the episode here, shouldn't we? Uh, let's quick check the computer before we go. Yes, okay. So, there's nothing listed. Um, there's a container marked with one of the vault seals, but it con its contents have been destroyed. I found a slide reel that shows the strangers and how it is analyzed in the eye of the universe. Intact slides reveal the construction and launch of a spacecraft designed to block the eye's signal. I found a slide reel that shows two artifacts being lit near a green fire. The first artifact lights after its bearer falls asleep, and the second artifact lights after its bearer dies. Ah. I found a slide reel that appears to be some sort of error report. It shows an alarm bell failing to wake up one of the stranger's inhabitants. Okay. Interesting. Okay, well, we're gonna go back to the stranger, but for now, that is it. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please let me know down in the comments below and maybe leave a like. And if you wanna catch the next episode as it comes out, go ahead and hit subscribe. But for now, that's it, so see ya!